Alrighty, everybody, welcome back to another video. We were playing some Draven in the mid lane. Just kidding. We're playing some Nico and we're going glacial today. We got glacial magical footwear, biscuit delivery, approach velocity, cheap shot, and ingenious hunter. I will win. I will grow. I will. Nico. You're against a LeBlanc. Should be alright in this matchup because uh, Nico is root. It's easy to hit LeBlanc with, because if she dashes right on top of you, you just throw it. Wherever she may be. I think they invaded our red. Because their bot lane's missing too. Do not be to a bot. There are so many more. Where are they? Ah, oh, there you are. We're gonna go GLP first, all the slow items. Be able to catch people very easy. Get a, yeah, he did uh, start bot side. Let me get a ward down there. Right, cool. So we have biscuits. We should be able to sustain with LeBlanc if she tries to fight us. Ooh, he's going to steal the. Oh, he's going to gank me. Oh, we might kill him here. Nope, never mind. Well, he didn't get our red. Ooh, that third auto does a lot of damage. See, yeah, LeBlanc is terrible at farming early, so if we push her in, he's gonna miss a lot of farm, but then we're gonna get ganked, so that's the trade-off. But even when she's not under turret, it's pretty hard to farm as LeBlanc. I took a little bit of attack speed in my runes too. Because Nico's autos do a bit of damage for a 3 hit. Yeah, I'm playing pretty passive because she does have Corrupting Potion. I'm going to wait for her to go in, because then I can guarantee land my root. See? We landed it. I'm just kidding. We fucking suck. Biscuit, Potion. I'll be back to full health shortly. That's still a decent trade. May as well use my Biscuits, because whenever I take this rune, I don't use them. His minion demon. Miss my auto. Cat just ran over my desk. We will be maxing our Q. See, she has no uh, potion left, so any damage we do to her now, she can't heal back. And also, if we burn her mana, we won't get any back. Oh, she flashed. I didn't even have root up. If I had root up, we probably could have killed her. That is the real LeBlanc right there. I actually miss like every route. I got her, but I'm dead. Ooh, you know what? I could have lived there. I actually didn't realize I hit level 6. I could have leveled it up really quick and ulted. It would have gave me a shield. Actually, no. I don't think it gives you the shield instantly. But still. Maybe could have done something. At least I got LeBlanc one for one. Not that bad. And uh, Lee Sin died too, right? We're gonna go to this. Uh, free boots. We could go Dark Seal. I'm gonna pick it up just because. I think we'll get more kills. But yeah, I'm missing a lot of my roots.
Yeah, I think I would have been dead anyway, even if I pressed R, it would have just wasted the cooldown. Because it takes like a second to get the shield and Lee hit the Q on me. I should have flashed away earlier and used my W before I got hit by the chain. I'm no Nico main. But she's fairly easy to understand. Did we even hit a root yet? I think we hit one early. Still have a biscuit. There we go. Wow, that does a good amount of damage. I outplayed her there. She missed everything. And Sajiwani was here to clean up in case it did go wrong. Okay. Plating? I don't think we'll go for two. You know what? We got so many minions. If Lee Sin doesn't have ult, we should be able to survive. Okay, dragon. That's good. How much are we off GLP? Might stay. 250. We could also sell a biscuit. We're full health, so we should stay for the item. Save instead. Should have ulted and went at her. Because after she uses her dash, she has nothing else to get away. Was Lee Sin low? He's probably full health. And I can't really hit him with my ult that easy because he can just kick me away. I gotta be ready to run bot side if Lee Sin ganks. Yeah, she's way too low to do anything. If I just uh, ignite her in auto, she's dead. I'm dead. Sejuani might get him. Yep. Okay, so at least I'm dying for kills though too. So it's two, two for one there. I'm Draven killed Singe too. Okay, so we got GLP. The LB pretty much suicided for me because she was going to die going in, but she did hit the chain and root me so Leeson can automatically land the Q. Um, do we go Merc Treads into LB? She's 0-3. She's not the biggest threat. I think we'll save our money. But now I have this item. This will make it a lot easier to get away from ganks and just killing LB. Yo, thanks for the 50 stars. Let's see the farm. We're ahead of her in farm a lot, too. He's since topside again. I have no potions. Let's hope LB just doesn't run out of the bush and fight me here. I don't know where she is, actually. I'm we'll gonna go run around with Sejuani. Oh, somebody's over here. Come on. Yes! <laughs> Wait, he jumped over the wall and then fucking the Herald just smacked his ass and he died. I didn't want to ult there because it's on a delay and I can't auto while I'm ulting, I think. She's stuck. Oh. Unless she does that. Man, this Draven with his alts is actually pretty good accuracy. Ah, 
I was thinking about taking minion demon at this game, but her wave clear is actually really well. We don't even need it. With biscuits instead, which worked well against LeBlanc poke. Once you're ahead of Le LeBlanc, it's very easy to win. She's a bad champion when behind. I don't think I could go for that. Yumi mid? You guys want me to do Yumi mid so bad, but like, I it's gonna be so hard for me to make it work. Let's see. Let's go uh, Twin Shadows next. I want boots, though. What boots do we want? We'll go Sorks just for damage. But if you were behind against LB, you'd go Merc Treads. Um, you could also go Armor Boots or CDR Boots. A lot of different things work on her. Get our wards down. Okay, that's pinked. Your team has destroyed a turret. Wow, just that auto shredded her. See, there's the kick. But luckily, I was able to get away. Shin's got him, I think. Nope. If I'd have kept walking up, he could have turned on me. It was close. Might have hit him, or I hit the chicken. Draven's pretty deep. Leeson's up there. He doesn't have kick, though, and Leeson was low. I even might be able to 1v2 this. Nah. Okay, Twin Shadows, we have two slow items, and we have Ingenious Hunter too, so they have lower cooldown. I think they need to do a little rework on Nico with her passive. It's useless for like 90% of the game. I can slow her again, I might be able to catch up because I have a approach velocity, I think is what it's called. There's a Lee over here. I think we could kill Singed easy. He only has armor. And I have a lot of slows for him. Oh, they lane swapped. Red's up. I'll just back Draven up, because there's going to be four of them up here. Never mind, Lee Sin is a... Uh, flat side, he's mid. I really want to go in here. It's like if I ult and then he hooks me, I think I hit them all. We'll probably go Hourglass next just so we don't die. Got 
him. Oh, that hurts. Come on, auto. Attack speed runes. Triple. Oh, that's my banana. No. Okay. Should have looked. I didn't think she would do enough damage to me since Draven was, like, destroying her. But I got Flash Storm Razored. That's still cool. LB's pretty much out of the game. She can't get money anywhere. So yeah, Hourglass puts us at 40% CDR, then we can use the Hourglass with our alt. Or we could go Oblivion Orb for more Magic Pen, or Leandri's, which is really good on her too. You know, I kind of want to get the Leandri's actually. That seems more fun. Hello, thanks for the vids. You're welcome. I don't have my Streamlabs open. Thank you for the donation. Maybe we can chase LB. Oh, she's screwed. We're actually doing a ton of damage for only having 200 ability power. Nico's base damage is very high. It's slow him. Not getting away. Okay, he got away. Oh, we got Lee. I suppose that's just as good as Blitz. There's a Singe behind us. Oh. Teamwork. Don't you guys know the golden rule of League? Oh shit, this guy is definitely a Draven player with how aggressive he is. Diving. And since she doesn't have Leandre's yet, so he doesn't really do that much damage. Oh, let's get him. I got Twin Shadows. I mean, we have nothing else to do on the map. We might as well chase him here. Oh, he sees me. That's why he sees me. Popped her. I wanted to hit Lee Sin too. My slow items are already back up in like 20 seconds. Alright. Goodbye, Lee Sin. Ooh, I missed. Okay, I'm gonna go grab my Leandries. Yeah, it didn't go Hourglass because we're we're pretty far ahead. Don't need the defensive stance anymore. I want to go um, what's it called? Majai's next for that move speed, so we go even faster. Oh no, I have the fastest move speed. I think. Sejuani's in trouble. Pull me. I dare you. There we go. And we make it out. Oh, shit. He wants me. I still know Leandri's. I would have died there if he had it. All right, I got a good alt off there. I should have used my um, W the other way and then walked in like this and invisible to alt. Gives them less time to react. 
but I'm not confident enough with it. Don't play her enough. Come back here. I actually played against uh, Bjergsen when he did this build against me. It's pretty hard to play against when they go Merc Treads too, because Nico's damage is very good. But lots of utility with uh, Glacial. Oh, thanks. It's a fat shield. Ooh. Okay. She didn't jump back to that one, I think. Or if she did, she was invis. Ooh, she's really low. What are we buying here? I could go Death Cap next, I could go Void Staff, I could go Oblivion Orb. Oblivion Orb would be better than Void Staff because they don't have any MR. That's why I'm doing so much damage. I'm like the only AP on the team because we have two ADCs. I think we'll go Oblivion Orb Blue Potion. That would give us the most damage for this buy since the game looks like it's going to be ending soon. This is the way to go. Alt does a thousand damage. Oh. Nice, didn't need to ignite. Alright, not gonna lie, I thought that was gonna land. I get so much move speed by people I slow. Because I already have a ton of move speed, and then approach velocity increases that by like 15%. We're also very low cooldown, too. It's not gonna kill me. I have built enough health. Nice. That attack speed did pay off, taking two. Because we got a lot of our kills with autos. Can we get a Penta? Nah, no Penta. Unless. Hey, I got it. I thought the. The turret thing was going to shoot me the fountain, but uh, Lucian helped me out there a ton. Makes up for yesterday, my Penta got stolen. Still have a 700 bounty. By the way, a lot of you guys comment like, Oh, why don't you upgrade the Oblivion Orb? You're sitting on the Morellas, you're so bad. No, it's actually not something you want to upgrade all the time. You only upgrade it if you want the healing reduction. It's actually... A waste of money if you upgrade it without it because you could start building something else that'll give you more ability power oh we didn't end the game okay more fighting it is did i get the blue potion yep okay
Mm, I'm about to end here. <laughs> I hardcore entered. My blue potion ran out. You know what? Maybe I would have got the kill if it was up. I needed flash there. Also, there's a build where you have proto belt on Nico, and you can proto belt right before the alt goes off, and that's a good way to catch people. But that is a different playstyle than Glacial. You wouldn't go Proto Belt with Glacial. Glacial Nico's utility. Or their Nico's just one shot. But people don't play anything other than Glacial Nico mid just because it's the only viable one in higher rank. I've actually seen uh, AP Nico, but they only play her as support because it's a little bit easier to get plays off. I flash in two minutes. I don't think I could kill Singe just because he's going to run away. I don't want to chase him. Roto Belt triggers Glacial too? I don't think so because it doesn't slow. I've never heard of Proto Belt triggering Glacial. Oh, wait. Alright, well. That was a perfect setup. Alright, well, GG. If you guys enjoyed the Nico game, make sure you like the video. And if you haven't, subscribe to the channel. Also, we go live on Facebook every day. So, the links are at the bottom of the screen on the left. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a great day.